uh, senior, my father, made three film scripts, or participated in making three film scripts. Uh, two of these were from his books. Uh, one was my uncle Jacinto, the second one was Paco Never Fails. Paco Never Fails is a wonderful story. Uh, the movie, unfortunately, has gotten locked to Spain and hasn't been shown outside. Uh, which means that I'm owed money from Spain, but uh, possibly also from the rest of the world. But the thing is that Paco has an amazing theme. In the 1940s in Madrid, and in most metropolis cities, no, got that wrong, uh, in most big cities, the, 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 um, the aristocracy, when they got pregnant, wanted wet nurses for to bring to, to, to feed their child and the, these wet nurses were brought in from the countryside where they had gotten themselves into unfortunate circumstances uh, often with the, the father running away so they left the child at home and they came with their breasts loaded with milk to Madrid to make a living as wet nurses, a fantastic living. Um, but uh, when the milk stopped flowing, uh, they had to get it going again. And the only way to do this was uh, through becoming uh, pregnant again. And uh, the man who was most likely to get these wet nurses pregnant was the one in highest demand. And there was a real life character called Paco, Francisco Garcia, I think was his real name, uh, Paco, who knew how to manipulate to uh, and count the days between menstruations, and he was allegedly, allegedly the one who never failed. So Paco Never Fails is the title of the book. It had only been translated into three languages when I got hold of it, uh, but now it's five or six. It's an amazing book and very well written. As I have translated it into English, I have adapted it so as to become a little bit of a murder mystery at the same time. Paco El Seguro, Paco Never Fails, is an amazing book and um, very much underestimated.